The Truth About Heart Evangelista. Love Marie Payao Long Palco Escudero, born February 14, 1985, better known as Heart Evangelista is a Filipina actress, TV host, singer, visual media artist, philanthropist, socialite and currently serving as the First Lady of the Province of Sorsogon. Early Life, Evangelista is the daughter of Reynaldo Evangelista Ong Palco, a restaurant magnate who belongs to a Chinese Filipino clan, and Maria Cecilia del Gallego Piao, whose family is from the Baikal province of Carmarine Sur. Evangelista is the last born child, with siblings from both sides of her parents. She was born in the Philippines and moved to the US before moving back to the Philippines in her early teens. She started her career at the age of 13 as a commercial model and actress. Career, 2000 to 2004, from 2000 to early 2004, she was paired with John Pratt's on the show G-Mick, Trip, and Tanging Ina, My First Romance and Burks. During the success of their Love a Team, they won as the most popular Love a Teams of RP Movies, of 2003, from 33rd Guillermo Mendoza Memorial Scholarship Foundation. Evangelista also won the Best New Female Personality, Best New Movie Actress and Best New TV Actress, awards from Star Awards for Movies and Star Awards for TV. She also won Texters and Listener's Choice at the Himmig Handog Awards for her single Love Has Come My Way. She released the single Tell Me in Australia where it peaked at number 18 on the charts. 2004 to 2007, in 2004, after four years, Pratt's and Evangelista's popular Real and Real tandem ended and the management decided to pair her with Jeff Eichmann in the movie BCUZ of You. Both of them also appeared on the TV series Hiram, with co-stars Chris Aquino, Dino Benevi and Ann Curtis for which she earned a Star Awards Best Actress nomination. In 2005, Jerrica Rosales once mentioned Hart's name, saying that he wanted her to be his leading lady in the series Pande. There were many women who auditioned for this role, but they chose Hart to play the role of Eden, the love interest of Tristan. Their tandem turned into a serious relationship and lasted three years. In early 2007, she renewed her ties with ABS-CBN and was under a per-project basis with her manager Angeli Pangilin and Valenciano. She finished a side series for The Station, the remake of the movie Hiram Namaka, and appeared briefly on Pangarap Nalbatuin. She also starred in the reformatted version of your song under the title Muntik Nakatang Minahil. 2008 Present, transfer to GMA Network. In early 2008, she signed a GMA Artist Center exclusive contract under GMA Network and she started her first show called an M, a Sero as a leading lady of Richard Gutierrez. She played a role as one of the twins in the fantasy Luna Mystica. Evangelista also appeared on her first afternoon TV soap sci novella, Ngin at KLM and which aired its final episode in September 2009. In late 2009, early 2010, she starred in a primetime Korean novella TV series, Full House. Evangelista hosts the musical variety show on GMA, Party Pilipinas. She appeared in the Christmas reality show Puso NG Posco, Artista Challenge on GMA Network, and she played a dwarf on Dwarfina. On late 2011, she signed an exclusive contract under Viva Entertainment. In 2012, she starred alongside actresses Alessandra De Rossi and Lovi Poe in the TV series Legacy which became a highly acclaimed television series throughout its run. She also was included in the afternoon drama Forever opposite co-star Jeff I. Genman. She then started her next project on Luna Blanca Book 3 onwards till its finale. The show is a sequel of her last soap Luna Mystica in 2008 of the same genre and in 2013, she was reunited with De Rossi in the afternoon soap Mejcano Barang Pag Ibig, under the direction of Mario J. De Los Reyes. In 2015, she and Legacy co-star Lovi Poe were reunited in the soap Beautiful Strangers, a melodrama. This was Evangelista's second time working with veteran actress Dina Benevi in a series with a huge ensemble cast. In 2016, she was reunited with Dwarfina co-star Dennis Trillo in the primetime rom-com One Happy Love Story. In September 2016, Evangelista experienced a series of depression after the passing of her mentor and close friend, former Senator Miriam Defensor Santiago. In 2017, Evangelista starred in Milan vs. Ravina. She also starred in My Korean Jagya, paired with former UKIS member Alexander Lee Eusebio. The show aired with a total of 105 episodes. During the 2018 State of the Nation Address in the Philippine Congress, Evangelista wore the iconic rainbow badge in support for equality in the Philippines and the passage of the pro-LGBTSOGIE Equality Bill. She was featured by Kevin Kwan's Real Crazy Rich Asians while staying in Paris during a high quarter week. Evangelista was one of People Asia's People of the Year 2018-2019.
visual artist, is an accomplished painter, Evangelista had sold out solo exhibitions from various galleries such as the Ayala Museum and Gallery Joaquin. She uses her real name, Love Marie, in her paintings. Her first solo exhibition was held at the Ayala Museum in 2014, entitled I'm Love Marie, The Art and Works of Love Marie Ong Palco. On the same year, she participated in the Visual Arts Festival through the Focus on the Arts, Art in Transit exhibitions. She also held her second solo exhibition on the same year at Gallery Joaquin through her Love Marie Gallery. Her third solo exhibition, Love Marie, a solo exhibition of a world-class Filipina, was held at the Raffles Hotel's Chan Hamp Galleries in Singapore in 2015. She also collaborated with Rocio Olbas's children's book, Daughter of the Sun and the Moon, and participated in the Art Fair Philippines 2015, Mart and Portrayal, LAYA, Portraits for Freedom Big and Small Art Company. In 2016, she collaborated with designer Mark Bumgarner through the LMXMB, When Art Meets Fashion, as well as with A.A. Padawaran through the book H.A.I. Naku and other poems. Her fourth solo exhibition was held at the Ayala Museum through her Oceans Apart Gallery. Her iconic hand-painted bags were also introduced on the same year at BMW BGC through her exhibition, Carry Your Heart. In 2017, she again collaborated with A.A. Padawan at the S. Mason Conrad Hotel through the H.A.I. Naka First Anniversary Exhibit. She also held, Heart and Style, a public exhibition of works of art at Fashion Hall of SM Mega Mall. In April 2018, she launched another art exhibit at Artist Space Gallery of the Ayala Museum. On the same year, she again collaborated with A.A. Padawaran through the book, Manila Was a Long Time Ago, which featured her pet dog named Penta. Her Follow Your Heart artwork was featured in the February 2019 U.S. edition of Harper's Bazaar. Charity and Advocacy, her foundation Heart Can aims to help children with respiratory diseases. Her foundation has been active since its inception and has helped thousands of children with special needs. Hart is also an LGBT icon and a recipient of Lega Blab Network's Equality Champion Award in the Philippines, being a strong supporter for the passage of the SOGIE Equality Bill, which provides protections on the basis of sexual orientation, gender identity, and expression. A known international painter, Hart is also active in the artistic community, notably in Asia. She is also a spokesperson for PAWS or Philippine Animal Welfare Society, launching various campaigns for the organization such as the Have a Heart for Aspen's campaign. She admitted in an interview that she was traumatized at a young age after seeing their neighbor slaughtering some dogs. When they told the authorities about the killings, her report was just made fun of. Hart has also been supporting the Balakatan Thalassemia for Children with Rare Diseases, Corridor of Hope for Children with Cancer and the Cerebral Palsy Association of Sorsogon where her husband hails from. Personal life, she is married to Senator Francis Chiza Scudero, the incumbent governor of Sorsogon. The pair were introduced by Evangelista's mentor, the late Senator Miriam Defensor Santiago, who was a close friend of her mother. On February 15, 2015, the couple went in a private ceremony at the Belisian Island Club in the Philippines. It was in the same year that Evangelista adopted a puppy saved by her father from the streets of Batangas. She named the puppy Penda, also sometimes referred to as Pankpan. In May 2018, Evangelista announced that she and Escudero were expecting their first child together. In the same month, however, one of the twins she was carrying was lost to a miscarriage. In June 2018, Evangelista announced that she suffered yet another miscarriage, losing the last of her twins.